What is it, 650? 660, I'm not sure. I think Triumph is an overlooked brand. It is, I'm not this, this, this is an $8,000 bike? Yep. Wow. This is, uh, this is... <laughs> what a shitter. <laughs> <laughs> Look how they get him. All excited, huh? Right? Ah, uh, Mr. Pico. Hey, good morning. I'm gonna be late today. I slept in, I was so tired. I got in last night. I'm gonna meet the guys. We're going for test rides on Triumphs. <laughs> Ouch. They got this helmet this time so I can, I can go for my coffee. Starts like that every time. Every time. Well, I'm a little bit late. Should be a nice ride out. It's been the last few days, been very hot. Sorry. Planning some really cool things on this bike. But today we're gonna go be riding, uh, you know, uh, test ride, test ride triumphs. Why not? I simply love it. I, I love, I'm an, admiring the new concept of drinking coffee while I'm riding. I just had a scary moment. Everybody was going like 80 on the highway and all of a sudden traffic in front of me stopped. The car in front of me literally hit the brakes and started to swerve. I grabbed on, I jumped onto the brakes, front and rear. And boy, did I learn that this bike, this bike's brakes are not what I'm used to from the low rider. First of all, there's no ABS. Second, it's a heavy bike. It's a really heavy bike. It's crazy. Woo! Adrenaline is pumping. Well, you learn, you learn. I gotta keep more distance from the cars in front of me. bad at all good morning here's Glenn's new BMW K 1600 B looks great with the holy shift sticker the dials 131 stage 2 the beast I took off how you doing brother what are you give me a handshake what are you crazy uh, I gave you I uh I took off the yeah those little <laughs> this the silly there was a little bit yeah, too was, much and there was silly. a ring a huge chrome ring yeah. I took that off as well you like my new pants? Beautiful, beautiful. Look at it. <laughs> Look at that. Oh. Look at them. Sexy. Cargo. <laughs> Sexy. Cargo. They're Kevlar inside. Beautiful. It's Beyond Riders. Nice. Really cool. Huh? You got a spot for your hammer. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like all, all the pockets, all the everything. Like, hey. Oh, oh look man. at Georgie. Georgie's got the Beyond Riders. You got the yeah. Beyond Riders. Nice. We all yeah. rock it, look. <laughs> Pretty cool, That's man. Awesome. We signed up. No, we, we're not going to ride me and you, but Glenn is going to give me <laughs> Why, are you too late? Here's Glenn. Glenn, good morning. Hey. Hey, how you doing? My man. How you doing? See Nice to meet you, sir. Hey, nice to meet you. Joe, pleasure to meet you. What was your name? Different Cross country, power sports. I don't even know. The touching. Rocking the Navi. Honda Navi. I got to try this one. Nice bikes. Oh, wow. Took all their yeah, this inventory. This is my favorite. 
<laughs> inventory out. Oh, you gotta try something. I'll hold the camera. Just try to lean this bike over. Just sit on it and, and kick it over. Am I allowed to? No problem. Yeah, yeah, no problem. Here. Watch, wait. Try. <laughs> keep keep going. going. <laughs> You need to be a bodybuilder. It's unbelievable. It's on. You take the camera the wrong way. Take a picture of yourself. Oh. <laughs> uh, Sandy, this what do you think? Nice and nice and light, right? It's well balanced. <laughs> it's heavy, and I can move my gold wing. And this is also has a, a low center of gravity. And that's why. That's why I'm saying. That's why I'm saying it, it, it's shocking for German engineers, especially mechanics. They this think about everything. Body. This is. I'm obviously, I'm exaggerating with my body language. But, but it is, it's pretty heavy. It is very heavy. But it, it's a nice feeling. I don't it's know. Really nice I just, feeling, it's, it, it's hideous. That's what it is. <laughs> it is. It's, there's no other word to describe it. <laughs> you said you want to see the Diablo? Oh, yeah. Want, oh, where is it? Inside, it's outside over here? Oh. Let's go see the Diablo. That's a nice. Scrambler. Nadal has something for Ducati. What can you do? It's a work of art. Oh, wow. Wait, wow. Wow. Actually, did I see one? I did not see one. That's a V4S, that's a regular one. Yeah. I think red is nice. Yeah, red pops. Red is like it pops, yeah. exactly. Like Ferrari style, Italian. Yeah. Ital it's Italian color. Yeah. Here, wait, you're gonna freak out. Watch. And the position is shut off. Wow, it's so light. <laughs> that's what I was what saying. What is it? What, how, what, how many? I don't know, but he's. How many cc is this? Like, that's a 12, 12, 1260, I think. Wow, it's so light. It's balanced and it just. Wow. Yeah, it's not that it's, the seating position is pretty nice, right? Yeah, it's a, it's a naked and it's really nice. Wow, right? Yeah, I was shocked. How much that, power does this have, by the way? I don't know. This has like 200 horsepower, 260 something. It, 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 it's a V4 engine, that's what's in the Pentagon. Yeah, V4S. Feels great. No, not the S, it's just a V4. We're, tr we're trying to teach Nadal over here how to use a camera. The l five minutes ago, he was like, the whole time he was trying to show me here, it looks at he was literally shooting his chest. I gotta show you. <laughs> we're, right. we're gonna make Spielberg out of him. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, and now, now it's too long, yeah. right? Yeah. And that one's a long And you're leaning forward yeah. a little bit over here. Yeah, it's different. Yeah. It's funny, it's different. That and one? it doesn't feel as light. Yeah, right? You notice? And that one's, I think, about $1,000 more only. I would go for the newer one. Yeah, that one, right? It's a really nice bike. Really nice bike. We're hopping on the BMWs over here. This is the uh, K1600. Both the Nadal and I love the R1250 RT. It's the bike that I actually reviewed when I was in Florida. I took it for a day. It's actually a very, very good video. It's, it was in, it was like 2018, but it was like this. The essence is the same. It's the it's the Boxer engine, the 12 1200 cc, the the same engine that they have in the G on the GSs, and it's I don't know if it's the same frame, I'm not sure, but it's like the handling on it is so good, the feeling, the the wind protection, everything was so sporty, so such a great bike. Not only that, look, if you go somewhere, you can take these bags, yeah, the handles. Yeah, when, was the last walk time, when was the last time you saw somebody walk into a hotel with two <laughs> with two motorcycle bags? <laughs> It's a feature that everybody likes. It's a marketing feature. Yeah, exactly. I, I've never seen anybody like, walk into a hotel with two. bragging rights. <laughs> I like know. Say, well, I know. You see, when I go, I don't need to. <laughs> yeah. Okay. A lot of behind the scenes kind of kind of stuff. Uh, a year ago, somewhere, I'm not sure where, what rally, uh, they let us. Uh, I wasn't there. They let everybody ride the bagger, the 1800, the 1800 cc BMW bagger. There was a lot of uh, mixed feelings about it. The look and finish were nice, very nice, everything high quality. But the thing is the design itself and the ride, a lot of, uh, some of the guys weren't really no, I would crazy. Say most of the guys, look, most look of the guys. This. You're sitting here, look, you're gonna hit the brake. It's, it's like, look, look at where your feet is with this big, if you have big foot, like, what, what are you gonna do, you know? it's. 
Yeah. And maybe it's for small European guys with small feet. And, and also probably you can't stretch your legs out. And then, right? then what are you going to do? You're going to put, put it on, on the, the hot, hot cylinder? Hot cylinder. Or, you know, it's not. And it, the bike was twisting when you hit the throttle. Yeah, but because it's sideways. Yeah. Every time you would, and, and the slower thing, you would feel it go side to side. So, it's weird. So I don't know how this bike, if it's a good seller or not. I'm not sure. but they And I'm not, I'm not bashing it. I have never ridden it. It looks really nice. So it became kind of like our joke because Glenn didn't like the bike. And whenever we go see a bike like that, we say, oh, this is Glenn's favorite bike. Anyway, and MSRP 27,460, the sale price, 25,460, 0.9 APR, a brand new bike. Is that a sign? <laughs> this is an $8,000 Vespa. We like to make fun of it always, right? <laughs> because it's like a, not a man's bike. These are so much fun to ride. They are. 30 years ago, I used I had a like a, an old Vespa two-stroke that used to start it from here, kickstart from here on the engine. The uh, the gear, the sh the shifting was over yeah. here a hand. And it had that brake. I saw it. It had a brake. Right. When, when... This is an eight thousand dollar bike. Yep. This wow. Is this, this is their top of the line. Here, hold it. Shoot, me. take a picture of me that way. Yeah. All right, it's good. <laughs> well, it's not a motorcycle. Mm -hmm. It's extremely light. <laughs> this cute little thing. This is not eight thousand dollars. It is. I'll show you right now. No way. It's eight thousand. I don't care what you say. Oh, you're not paying eight thousand, but it's that's eight thousand. What? I don't care what you say. What you? What you? Even if there's gold inside the glove compartment, <laughs> it's not eight thousand dollars. Look, it's got the sweet the headlight little there. Toy kind of thing. Yeah. Retro. I like the color too. Yeah. It's not. It is eight thousand, Sandy. That's yeah. yeah. Right then, that's my bike for the ride. It's what they have, the only spot they have. So I'm offered to ride it, of course, I'm gonna take it. Don't worry about the bike, don't worry about liability, anything else, because nothing's gonna happen. But if you start- Very light bike, 660. What a 650, 660, I'm sure. Light bike. Naked, sport. <laughs> Very nice bike. Wow. Really cool bike. It really I'm is. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry I didn't have the, ca the, the camera with me when I was on it. Literally. I want to start on this one. That one's nice and tight. This is like so nice. You know, I think, uh, what'd you think? I think Triumph is an overlooked brand. It is. I'm like this is the second too. bike that I've been on. I was on the Rocket. On the Rocket, which was like such a surprise for me and this one as well there was a smile on my face the whole time it's small nimble yeah that's what i was saying it's and uh you're you're, so you're sitting no so no you're smiling. sitting it's a lot of fun you're sitting in a in a very aggressive stance but and it's it but it's comfortable braking on it was crazy i just got off i got off my gold wing i was i was locking my hands on the gold wing over here nothing like a cliff unbelievable Really, really nice. It's exciting. The only thing I would uh, change is the pipe. The pipe is a little bit too, and the power delivery on it is really nice because you got three cylinders. It's always there's always a knock of power somewhere. Yeah, it's, it's not a there's one. Yeah, it's not thump 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 thump. It's offset. First one, so it's it's very close to what you say that when they talk about the what's what's nice. You know they talk about. Uh, electric electric motors electric motors that they always have constant torque at every point that's what you feel on this it's always some some sort of uh of so it's quick shifter ready yes and i was trying it the whole time it wasn't it was it was grinding every time the quick shifter and then, <laughs> then finally i gave up <laughs> quick shifter was grinding huh no bad quick shifter was grinding up and grinding down so like after four four or five attempts maybe 10 attempts i just stopped <laughs> that's a good idea don't tell them all right <laughs> no just just kidding obviously just kidding but it does have the setup ready for it this is where the quick shifter will go 
and it's no, it's just a flash on the ECM. Oh, on the ECM, I got you. So, so literally, okay. That's so you probably pay another yeah. a little yeah, amount I think it's of like dollars. Hundred and but it's such a nice, it's such a, a, a you're nice. You're excited. You no, like listen, it. it's a really enjoyable bike. Bike. How much yes. does a bike like this cost? Is, and the, they're below not, ten. They're not expensive. Below ten. Yeah, yeah it's, it's probably below ten. Yes, I would say. And it's right at. You know, the Yamaha has the CP3, which is the three-cylinder. This is the Trident. And the, the experience of uh, three cylinders is always having uh, one of the cylinders in uh, one of the pistons in action, giving you power. So linear, so cool. Very nice, very nice, sweet little fun ride. Triumph is an overlooked brand, in my opinion. Us Harley guys uh, talk about uh, the Harley every once in a while. We'll, we'll talk about a metric bike. But we're referring to a Japanese bike and their reliability. But this British bike has been around and it's really, really good. I think it's literally overlooked. It was the only bike left because we came in late. So I said, okay, I'll take that bike. Actually, I didn't take that bike. Glenn. Glenn was nice enough to give me to give me his his spot. And I said, okay, I'll take this little scooter, this moped. I was, it was fun. It was a fun bike. You, you can tell now I, look in your face. Yeah, now I see why you have a Triumph. And we should, I should do something about Triumphs, you know? It's, it's getting me, you know, starting to think about Triumphs, you know? Hint, 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 hint. Okay, we're done with the ride. Uh, the guys are going for some lunch. and diversity. We got four bikes over here, four different brands. The Dal is on his Harley 131. George is on his Indian. Not sure what it is, I forgot. The, I'm not too familiar with the brand. Glenn is on his BMW K1600 and me, the Goldwing. Inclusiveness, diversity, that's us. Jose's whole meals have never eaten here in the Dahl's recommendation. Always be careful when you recommend a, a restaurant, if it's bad, you screw everybody and they'll never forget that. Uh. Yeah, music always kills our videos. Music, can't put it on. Happy New Year, Happy New Year. Happy New Year. For me. <laughs> what I will say, my love it. Look at that jalapeno. Yeah. Thank you. I'm not. I'm not good. No, no. I'm not good with. Uh, I'm not good with spicy stuff. Have a jalapeno. That's not spicy. No. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh, you can eat that? Oh my God. Yeah. Just oh my God. You can eat the seeds. That's, that's no, no. I'm not going to. He can eat the seeds. seeds. I'm not going to even try. No way. He eats the seeds and he has to be on the I don't eat that. I eat them. I, I take the seeds out. Shrimp tacos. Ooh. Little jambalaya. What's the jambalaya? There it's, it's a uh, spicy rice. Rice, yep. What is this? We got the same thing? Shrimp. Mmm. killing it. Killing the game. <laughs> <laughs> Our beef, steak, chicken, jambalaya. Jambalaya. Beans or something. Cheese, sour cream, pico de gallo. There we go. Ah, I'm gonna show them the pita right now. <laughs> Build your own pita. Taco. Pico. 
Biko, just like your dog. Biko. <laughs> My son's like, Baba, I like Biko. <laughs> they said the big... The spices they put in there yeah. are pretty good. All done, all done. That was a nice lunch. We can hit the road now. Bro, I'm almost home. Wait, let me pick my nose with the glove. Almost home. But before I go home, I want to I want to take you somewhere. Remember years ago, uh, before we were married, I I was like that. I'm sure you were as well. And you were dating, taking girls out. There was always a special spot your spot that you like to take the girl uh, to show her and eventually make out a little bit. Well, I'm taking you to my spot that I used to. Well, it's not my, my I need to take the girls here. It's where I take all my motorcycles. It's pretty much where I like to take all my motorcycles and uh, take videos of it, put pictures. But here I wanna I wanna discuss, I wanna tell you something about uh, artificial intelligence and uh, YouTube as well. How nice is it over here, huh? Turn off the bike. Let me tell you something. I was gonna talk to you about artificial intelligence and the YouTube algorithm. You see a lot of websites, a lot of channels asking for you to subscribe. I don't do it that often. I just post, I just post uh, like a little thing like that right now. And the truth is, I don't give a fuck about if you subscribe to my channel or not. And I'll tell you why. The artificial intelligence that works with uh, YouTube knows whether you like whether you subscribe to me or not, the fact that you're watching my videos and the fact is that you're actually watching this part means and shows to YouTube that you like my video. So next time you're on YouTube, YouTube will actually suggest my video to you regardless if you're subscribed to me or not. So that's why I don't really care if you subscribe to me or not and I don't push it that much. Who actually does care and does mind are my sponsors, my sponsors and people that look at my channel. They wanna see how many subscribers I have and how much influence I have. For them, it's important if I have a lot of channel, a lot of subscribers. Fact is, the watch time that I have and the amount of video, amount of people that watch my, each of my videos is, uh, is actually equivalent to a much bigger channel. I am getting the views, I am getting the watch time. But for my uh, sponsors, it's important for them to see how big I am, you know, how many subscribers I have. That's why I uh, actually do appreciate if you subscribe to my channel so the sponsors see how many, how many subscribers I have. And then they want to collaborate with me and send me stuff, send me gear, send me things for the motorcycle so kind of I can install and develop this channel. So for me to put out a video like this takes about, I would say six, seven, eight hours of writing, editing, and putting it out. And all that's required from you is one second of clicking that uh, subscribe button. So guys, do my sponsors a favor and just subscribe to the channel. Make sure you hit that notification bell because you know the rest. Uh, let's, let's head back home. Uh, need to remember to do that. It, guys I'm home it was a nice day out back and forth with the wing and then uh, spending time on that triumph was really cool hope you enjoy this one guys I'm Sandy watching holy shift till the next video guys peace out
How cool is that trick, huh? Yeah.